everybody so day it today is day two and I have just been crazy busy working on other YouTube videos my personal life uh, my school my son's project that a teacher wanted me to work on so I just been busy but today is day two it is November 1st a lot of you guys got to see the new video that I just posted of my cleaning from last week and a lot of you guys, I thank you very much for being supportive. But today, I'm just going to take down my Halloween decorations just because I just want to get it done. Um, I have my totes been sitting here for like, you know, a couple weeks and I just want to get it done. May, may, then I can start picking up my house a little bit more. But today, we're just going to take down um, all this stuff. I'm going to pack it all up, pack all that up. I did have two uh, little skull guys sitting outside my front porch, so I ended up getting those down, and then I ended up having a little ghost um, that I had lit up, and I ended up having him get blown up earlier today so he could dry off, and then I just packed him up, so I'm going to pack him up also. So that is what I'm going to work on, so let's start cleaning. Okay, so I finally finished the mantle. I put everything away, all my... Oh, I forgot one sign, but all my Halloween decorations are done. Now the next thing I'm going to do is just kind of wipe this down because it's a little dusty. I have a couple of DVDs or Blu-rays that I was watching. And then this stuff I'm keeping up all year long. But uh, I do feel good that I got it done. So tomorrow we're going to work on a new project. Hey everybody, so I have been slacking. Today is actually Friday. I can't remember what I did for the week of the cleaning. I just been crazy busy um, just doing things and getting things prepared. I have a craft show coming up so I've been busy with that. But I said I was going to clean my dresser today or I was going to clean my dresser this week. I was going to work on my stockpile and I was going to work on my bathroom closet. But things happen and this is something that I wanted to do like the previous week. And so since right now I'm trying to find some breakfast because it's in the morning and today I'm just going to kind of work on a lot of my weekly cleaning stuff. The kitchen hasn't been what I want it to be so I'm going to work on the kitchen again today like um, I just went couponing I've been working so I'm going to get this all cleared off again. I'm going to get this 100% cleared off again but it has been better than what it has in the past. I actually have Christmas gifts on the island that I got to go put away but um it has been much better than it's been in the past. But anyways, I want to organize my pantry closet because I have a lot of crap in here that it's getting old and needs to be thrown away. We have cereal, which is fine, but I have cereal containers and my kids don't use the cereal containers and then our cereal goes bad. So I'm going to show you guys this cabinet right here. So this is something I'm just going to work on right now. I was just kind of going through it right now. I'm like, wait, let's just stop and I can show you guys what I have. So like we have some turntables and I, I was looking for my honey the other day and I'm like, really? There it is. So there I have it. But um, I'm going to go through this, organize it a lot better. So that's what I'm going to work on today. And then along with the kitchen, and I'm probably going to work on my stockpile stuff today too. But I'm also going to work on this cabinet too. Yeah, I'm going to work on this cabinet too. Um, I have a lot of junk food that just needs to get out of there. A lot of junk food that just needs to get out, thrown away. Some of that stuff's like been there for a long time. Um, so that is my goal today is working on that. I'm going to actually work on it right now because I'm hungry. I got to find some cereal and organize some stuff. I mean, this is what's, this is how bad it is. I found some like honey wheat or whatever. It's just, oh, now it broke, but it's just like solid. And then there's a spoon in it. So I'm going to be washing a lot of containers today and get an all fresh everything in there. So that's what I'm gonna work on. But like I said, I don't remember what I did. I know I cleaned on Monday and then I can't remember what else I did. Oh, I took my Halloween decorations down on Tuesday. Wednesday I was just making stuff like crazy. Thursday I go to Walmart and that takes a lot of my time and then my in-laws came over and I just did not have any energy. I've been tired, I'm not sleeping very good. But today I'm gonna kinda get some stuff done. It's gonna be a crappy day outside, so you know what that means. Let's clean, so one more look at this cabinet. You guys can see that. And then my kitchen, that's gonna get cleaned up. And this, 
so let's start cleaning and I just remembered I forgot to take that down so yeah hey everybody so it is still Friday and I'm still going at my closet I just been working on other things I went on live today but I do want to share with you guys again that I did empty this out I emptied all of the top shelf out but all I have up here is like sugars and spice um, sugar you know flour all the ingredients you need to like bake stuff with I am doing a lot of this stuff out I have a little bit left of things here um, I've gone through three garbage bags full of stuff just stuff because nobody knows how to seal anything so I'm gonna make this like this shelf right here the chip shelf like any chips and all that stuff because um, I just put the sh chips somewhere else and then I forget where they're at. So only chips. And then I ended up opening all the popcorn packets and putting them in there. And then I just put the, um, I just put the, uh, um, pop tarts that I had right there too. So that's just going to be the popcorn and chips. And then there's a couple things back there. I've also been working at, um, putting all these in containers. Like I just, like it when it's organized and my son likes it better so I just been putting things in containers so we have it um, for that and then I'm also working on this closet I emptied out a lot of stuff in here already I'm just kind of organizing it a little bit better my husband likes having his alcohol like all on display and it's like no this isn't like a display area for your alcohol this is for us to put food in so we have a lot of pens and pencils, so that's just kind of sitting back there. But I put all of his stuff on there, and then we have our little Lazy Susan of little condiments that I'm still going through. Again, these are more chips that I have to put in that corner cabinet. So I'm still working on that, but I have a lot of things I've gone through. And yeah, and then I kind of just straighten up the floor. So I'm gonna continue working on this. Like my son just had some chips. And he wants me to put like this bag of chips in a container, but I don't have a container big enough for it. But it's perfect for sitting back there. And if all the chips are together, then I won't forget like, oh yeah, we had those chips and then they won't go bad. So I'm still working on the closet. Um, my husband will be home in about an hour. So I'm actually just gonna kind of clean up my mess that I have right now and get everything put away, put away and organized. And I can always clean up some more tomorrow. But I feel happy with what I did. It gives me more countertop space. Like, I can put all of our crackers up here. Um, I ended up having these, like, little Chex Mix little snacks that I put in this little little box that we have. So I'm going to put those so people can see them. And then I'm going to put all, like, the hamburger helper, stovetop, all that stuff on this, the lower shelf. But I feel happy with what I've done. I mean... I got crackers, right? I got crackers. And the crackers end up going bad um, or the box gets smashed or something, but ended up having this little container right here. So I put all the crackers in there and then we have these two crackers and they fit nicely in this little container. So this is gonna be like a little cracker bin. It'll be easy to assess it, but I'm pretty happy with how everything is turning out to be less waste of food because half the time we didn't know what we had because everything was all over the place but if i keep all the chips in one section we'll know what we have for chips and they won't go bad if i keep all the cookies in one section i know where all the cookies are if i keep the crackers all together in one section i know where all that stuff is so that's what i'm going to keep it at but if i don't finish this tonight because we have to leave to go somewhere i will definitely show you guys what it looks like tomorrow okay you guys I actually was gonna finish this later and then I just got ambition to just put everything away and I did I didn't get a chance to clean my kitchen but I did clear off a lot of it and I'm still in the middle of cleaning off my kitchen but tomorrow is supposed to be just as crappy as weather so I will end up um, fixing it or cleaning it a hundred percent tomorrow and I'll probably make a video for it I found some candy hearts in my stockpile the other day and so they don't expire till end of next till the middle of next year so i thought they're still good and i've been really enjoying putting these in containers now i really love putting stuff 
in containers. I have a couple containers in my dishwasher that I need to wash. And I gotta put a couple that are in my sink to wash. But I do feel like I accomplished a lot. I got rid of three bags. Um, in my opinion, I know some people are like, that is such a waste putting things in containers. It is true. But when you have little children who don't seal stuff up, like I have some Oreos right here. Um, and I will put put in some Oreos. They don't these don't seal very well. So most likely these are probably um, stale. But I plan on putting them in this little cookie jar. And so I try to do that because then the kids will be careful with it. They will make sure it seals tight and then it's less waste because we'll actually eat it. Because half the time I throw a lot of this stuff away. But I, like I said, I showed you guys my top shelf. I might take it apart and kind of organize it back a little bit more. But these are just all cookies. There's it's and uh, noodles. I have a lot of noodles back there. Um, but mostly just cookies and noodles. There is a lot of lot of space back here. There's a lot of space in here. But all I have is just chips, chips, and chips and chips, which I do like because all the chips can stay fresh in one area, and we're good. And then I have the popcorn. So that is one area that I cleaned out and I feel very happy. I haven't cleaned out that cabinet that good in years. And then we have this cabinet right here. And according to how, I'm not gonna have it like, you know what, some of these people have it perfect to a T. This is perfect for me. It's all organized. You can see everything. We got some stuff on a Lazy Susan so I can just start dropping everything. But I got some stuff on a Lazy Susan. I had the kids give me some of their Halloween candy so we could seal it up and just have it sit there. I got some other stuff. I got peeps that don't expire till 2024. I got some little snacks that I put in these little boxes that are perfect to just organize. Here is where majority of all the cereal is. I do have some turtles um, because my kids eat a lot of that stuff. But this is where the cereal is and that means I can actually have a bowl of cereal and not have to worry about it going bad. So I have, uh, I have eight cereal containers and these, I have one in the dishwasher. Then down here, and then my husband has some rice and then these are all his little noodle meals that I have all in this little container, which is perfect for that. Then we have down here, there is a plenty of space in here, but I have, again, you know, here we got some Teddy Grahams, I got some candy, animal crackers, pretzels, Oyster crackers, I got some caramel popcorn, I got some chocolate bunnies, so it's all empty behind here. Oh, and I got another container. Look at that. Got another container. And then here's where I just put all the crackers because the crackers, or my kids eat through crackers. More goldfish, more goldfish, and then I just put some boxes right here because I can see them at this. I mean, I feel like we can't see very much because there's a wall right here, but I feel like I can see these so much easier. So got that stuff right there then my husband has a lot of his tools and junk down here and since this is a harder spot to see i thought this is perfect for him to just keep his stuff here i have some snacks and stuff to put in the lunch boxes right here this was all that was loose inside his inside this closet or pantry as we turned it into be so i just put it on a basket and he can deal with it i got a lot of paper plates and napkins back there and then here is where we keep some bottle of soda um soda we have some lunch boxes back here i have to organize a little bit better and then we have a uh, rice cooker but other than that i think it's pretty good i got a smashed roll up that's nice so i think i did pretty good i still have a I have to still clean up just a little bit more oh and i found some high c look at that found some high c that i didn't know when did it expire not till april Sweet, we have some juice. I can put that in the fridge. But I feel happy with everything that I did today. Um, we're gonna keep it this way. This is easier as long as I keep it in the containers. It stays fresh. I'm pretty happy with what I did. Here I have a lot of, I have like four crock pots and more paper plates, napkins. I have spices that go in my spice cabinet and I just see another, oh, another container. I don't know how long this has been sitting there, but we're gonna just move some stuff around. But yes, I got empty big bowls and plates and stuff, but I feel pretty happy with what I did. I got basically two birds with one stone. 
I'm gonna sit and relax for once because I haven't had a chance to do that at all. And then tomorrow I am going to work on my stockpile. Um, but I'm happy I have energy and then I'm also gonna clean my kitchen tomorrow. So I will see you guys tomorrow for a bonus cleanup day because I slacked earlier this week.